Hello everyone and welcome to Blistech Solutions Tuesday Tech Tips. Today's tip we're going to show you a handy hint of how you can do formatting using shortcut keys in Word. Uh, you can also use it in Outlook and it's very uh, useful to quickly add bits and pieces of formatting to your documents and emails. So here we go. So here we have a Word document that I've created, a uh, blank Word document, and let's imagine we want to add some formatting, uh, we want to add some numbers. Um, I've increased the font so you can see it a bit easier on the screen, but if you want to add a numbered list, simply all we do is start typing one full stop and it will automatically add a numbered list. Hit enter, goes to the next line, and so on. We can also add um, sort of uh, additional sort of le uh, levels to our numbering. So if I do one dot one dot, and it will add a, a sort of a sub list again, uh, and then from then on it will automatically in increment the numbers as we go on. Pretty handy. If you want to do bulleting, so rather than trying to find where the bullet menu is up here, simply type asterisk, which is shift and eight. Hit end uh, it space and then it will start to build the bulleted list. Nice and handy, you can type properly. Um, let's imagine we want something a little more fancy than that. If you hit the greater than sign, which is shift and full stop, and a space, it will add a lovely little um, arrow shaped bullet point in there for you, which is also very nice. Some other things we can do, we, so we imagine you want to create some separation in your document by adding lines and stuff and you might you know, not know where to find that is in the menu. If you simply hit the minus key enough times and hit enter, it will automatically add a line. So you can uh, separate, separate your documents. You can also add um, uh, a double line by hitting equals and go again. And if you use the tilde uh, sign, which is shift and hash and hold that down, you get a lovely little zigzag line. Um, there are lots of other shortcuts, and I'm not going to go through all these now. So have an experiment, see what you can uh, see what you can do. But this should help you add some nice little bits of separation and formatting in your document really quickly. I hope you found it useful. I'll see you again next time.